good evening everyone. If you have a question, raise your hand and we'll come to you. Are all ready, cameras ready at the back? All good. We'll come start at the front. Uh, what went wrong? What went right? Sorry? What went wrong? What went wrong? We concede two and I score two. <laughs> I think what went wrong is, is the start of the game. I think we didn't play with an odd purpose with the ball and clarity and, and we were just moving the ball without really having the the intention to thread them and that's a really dangerous thing to do against teams like Chelsea. And then we didn't win enough duels and in tight areas when we had them, they escaped from that and they attack open spaces and they are really, really dangerous things to do. So credit to them as well because they are a top side, full of top players and, and you have to acknowledge that. And, um, and we don't have those two things and we become an average team. When we changed that and we started to leave the level after 20, 25 minutes and especially the second half, that's a different game. We became a, a much better team even with though they consider the second goal and his disappointment, um, the way the team reacted is, is phenomenal. Well, the players that they were here, the players that they are on the bench thinking how the hell I'm going to change the game and help the team. So that's the part that I loved. And, um, and what I really liked as well is going to the dressing room and the dressing room being quiet after drawing 2-2 two -two against Chelsea and being tuned down because I know that they want more. So that's the positives. James from CBS. Mikael, what did you make of the I already mentioned it to a rep and I got booked for that, so I prefer to make no comments. You're not happy with it, right? Eh? You weren't happy with it. Not happy with the yellow, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. Sir? Oh. Just, just on that Sorry, point, sir. I mean, uh, we always have this debate about whether we think the law is right and whether we think the law has been, and then whether the law has been applied correctly. Did you think, do, do you think A, the law is right and B, has it been applied correctly? Well, but the law is clear as well. In, in, in where the ball has to be in relation to the action. And it's very close and it's impossible to jump without lifting your hands. It's just mechanically, it's impossible. Professor Rob? Yeah, Mikhail, the character of this side was, was questioned maybe at the end of last season. And I just wondered in, in you know, a game in which you look to be going away from them to come back to, to get the two tools, maybe look like they're winning it. Does, does that tell you something about the progression of character in the individuals you have? Yeah, I have no doubt about that. And I could see at half time that it was a night between our teams and we accepted that we have to do much better. And the game still was there for us. And we had that belief. And even we considered the goal the way we considered it, we continue to be like this. And I love that about the team. And I'm going to demand in that every single day because this is who we are and, um, and the only way as well to, when you are not at your best, still create a lot of issues to the opponent. Thank you. Yeah, I haven't seen it live again, so it looked at from the angle, it's very strange angle to to consider, I didn't know if it was a deflection or, or is the trajectory of the ball. Anyone else? So goal. Sorry. Goal. Yeah. Great. I love him. I will sing as well for him every single day. We sang a lot for him yesterday because he was a father, the most beautiful thing um, to do. And he's someone that has this charisma and personality and is very loved around the team. Okay. Anyone else at all? In the front there, Jerry? Just the, the, about Mr. Bobby Sharp, one of the greats we lose. Yeah. Really sad news, but I think he leaves us. Um, in, in, in the best position that you can be as a footballer, the values that he transmitted, the quality and how he changed English football, how he changed um, international football, the appreciation that he had and the love that he had for everybody, the respect that he had for everybody. So obviously he already had legacy, but I think that's going to be beyond what he already had. So rest in peace and I think everybody appreciates and I love what he did for this game. Thanks, Sam. Well, first of all, that he's very good and he's got this mentality as well to be always willing to help the team. And um, and he had an injury that he wasn't fit enough to play the last um, uh, the last few games. Then he played against City. He had to come off and he worked really hard in international break to be able to be fit again. And those things is like with Martinelli, changes momentum of season, you know. And I could see that he was ready to come in. Very intelligent run, the, the way he anticipates the, the cross and, and the action, and then obviously the way he executed because it's still yeah. not easy to score. And finally, we go to Dave. Were you surprised that it took 71 minutes for Cucurella to get a yellow card for fouling Saka? 
I've been surprised by many things, so I'm not going to get surprised by that. <laughs> okay. Okay, Rob. Good evening. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Safe, yeah, safe, yeah. Safe journey. Thank, thank you very much.